So, ladies and gentlemen, Sim Update 10 has now been out for around about 4-5 to five days and I've had ample time to test the various aspects and features of the Sim. For those of you guys who haven't seen my previous video covering every single thing that is new with Sim Update 10, you guys can either check it out on the top right hand corner of the screen or in the description section of the video. However, for today's video, we're going to be doing a complete unadulterated performance test between Sim Update 9 and Sim Update 10. We're going to be taking a look at everything, including the NVIDIA DLSS settings, the AMD fidelity effects, sharpening textures, and so, so much more. So for all of that, stay tuned. What is going on guys, Flyby Simulations here, and as I said, today's video is going to cover everything that is to do with the performance of the simulator after updating to Sim Update 10. I have heard quite a few pleas in the comment section of my previous video saying that a lot of people have suffered performance degradations after Sim Update 10, whereas other people have said that they've seen massive improvements to Sim Update. Now, my first impressions of Sim Update 10 is that there are certain performance improvements, flat out FPS increases that you might see in certain situations, however, the entire experience of navigating around Flight Simulator 2020 has been massively improved in that it feels smoother, it feels sharper, it feels crisper, and in most ways it just feels better for me than Sim Update 9. Now obviously the long test we have in the video today is going to show everything in terms of the hard numbers behind these feelings, however, that's just my initial impression. Loading times have been improved, the overall FPS in various different scenarios seems to have been improved, and the overall smoothness of the sim, especially when panning around cockpits and so on, has also been improved. Now, talking about the logistics of the test, we're going to be testing this sim in three different conditions. One is going to be a takeoff test from Romeo Juliet Alpha Alpha, Tokyo Narita International Airport in the PMDG 737. The next test is going to cover an evening arrival into KMDW, which is Chicago Midway International Airport. And finally, we have a nighttime approach into Dublin International Airport. So I think these three tests are going to give an accurate representation as to what we can expect from Sim Update 10 going forward, especially considering that there are are going to be hot fixes and driver updates that are going to make this better going forward. Finally, towards the end of the video, we're also going to be comparing the same situations I mentioned, however, using DLSS. So we're going to be doing a Sim Update 10 without DLSS versus Sim Update 10 with DLSS comparison. So stick around for that as well. As was the case with my previous performance comparison video for the previous update that came out, my PC specs are linked down in the description section below. However, the TLDR version of my specs is also on screen right now for you guys to view. Anyways, with that all said, I think we are ready to proceed to the first test at Tokyo. However, the final thing I would like to say is that these videos do take a little bit of time to put together. I had to sit and record various different things on Sim Update 9 to then compare it to Sim Update 10. So if you guys can appreciate all that effort, a like reading on the video would be massively appreciated. And if you guys want to stay up to date with all of the Flight Sim news, previews, you know, product reviews and so on, make sure to subscribe to the channel and also hit that little bell icon right next to the subscribe button so you guys can stay notified every time I upload a new video. Also, I would love to know your thoughts down in the comment section below as to what you think of this update, how your experience has been, and so on. I would love to engage with you down in the comment section, so do leave your thoughts down there. So, with that all said, I hope you guys enjoyed this comparison video, and thanks for flying by. Light slope. 
quite slow. Sink rate. Fifty. Thirty. Twenty. Ten.
wide slope. Wide slope. Yeah. 